size of a pumpkin. That must have been really something. <laughs> you made it. Huh? Follow me. Now, uh, like I said in my letter, we are going into business. I've been breaking down animals since I was knee-high to a splinter. And I worked as a tanner up in Wisconsin back in the 60s. Uh, that's a very long story. So I've got three words for you. Cripps Trading Company. Pristine pelts and animal parts for bulk sales. I know the market's there. All I need is a partner. So, I'm thinking, you source the materials. Skins, plumes, horns, and the like. I'll clean them and prep them. Then you go out and make the sale. Hell, we might even eat well out of this for once, too. Wouldn't that be nice? <coughs> Why are you still here with us? Your provisions, Mr. Oh, Cripps. Oh, yeah. Right, uh, pack the rest on there, will you? Now, uh, with any opportunity comes risk. The competitors, thieves, me losing interest in the whole idea. But if we combine our talents, we'll be unstoppable. Now, I will require a, an initial modest investment, of course, startup costs and such like, but you'll recoup that as fast as you can say, hey, Cripps, you handsome genius. <laughs> so how about it? Are you in? My talents extend... Sure, why not? It's free. Good. Now, you won't regret this, I promise. Now, I've already got hold of a small wagon and most of what we'll need in terms of initial supplies. If you can grab that and bring it back to camp, we'll get everything set up. This is gonna be fun. Come on. Alrighty. Hello, everyone. Thank you again for coming back with me on Addicted or on Red Dead Redemption 2 Online. Uh, with me, Addicted to Life. Today, as you can see, we are starting up the trader. We started up the collector last night and haven't really done anything with it, but I really wanted to start this up next, so been working on the bounty hunter slowly but surely leveling up, so I'm almost at level five on that. Um, at level ten you can unlock the uh, the cage basically and you can haul around you know, ten bodies or whatever. So hopefully make money on that sometime. I get to that, but I was told I should start up this because you can make some really good money on it, so uh, here we are, doing the trader. And I believe we are going to call it. Jesus, don't run me over, don't run me over. This is a newer horse, I got it for free if I have Twitch Prime. Um, oop, oop, oop. He's a little shorter, he's really bulky, which is cool. I mean, I guess he's a fast horse, but yeah, he, uh,. It's really short compared to other horses, I guess, so... Other than that, pretty nice horse. Where are we going? Alright, there we go. Hey, you better be paying attention. Get to the wagon, he says. If I shoot this guy first... You have to worry about him, right? Oh, crap. That's how you do that. Alright. Wagon we go. So this is just like the other, once you get to roll 10 uh, on the trader, you can unlock a bigger wagon, and that'll be awesome, just because it's not like this holds a lot, but it doesn't hold as much as the uh, big wagon, obviously, so that's my goal, to get this level up to level roll 10, and get the bounty hunter up to 10, so I can get both wagons. But yeah, my uh, buddy last night sold a full one of these, I made like 50 bucks being a partner with him, in his clan or crew or whatever, but he said he, I swear to God, he said he pulled like $600, and I was like, damn, that's, that's the kind of business I need to get in, so he said, yeah, that's, that's going to help you, and it's real easy to do it, so I said, why not, let's do it. The thing I wish you could do is I wish you could um, choose the horse you have, but that's right. Well, what do you think? Crips Trading Company is officially up and running, so get out there and do some hunting. Time for us to make our fortune. I need some luxury and repose in my twilight years. 
If there's a fellow on this green earth that deserves a drink more than me today, I'd like to meet him. Anyway, uh, don't let me keep you. <clears throat> Sorry, too deep. Anyway, I have some good news. Another batch ready for market. Well done, Crips. You're amazing. Why, thank you. Now it's over to you. Buyer's local, so should be an easy enough sale. Alright, so we are finally trading the goods. This is actually my second time, and hopefully nobody shoots us, because what is it? We are by ourselves. But I equipped my shotgun and my reaper, so I hope, or my repeater, so I hope nobody contacts us, but if they do, that's what that's there for, and hopefully, yeah, I can make it. So, it says it's not too far, so I'm hoping it's right down the road. I'm not really too sure. So right now, if you have the small car, it's only a $12 difference. Um, if you go from short to long, so it's almost not worth it to go the extra mile for $12, because now it's actually a lot easier to grind out money. So that's why I went and chose the uh, shorter course for 68 instead of 70... 66 for 78? Something like that. It's like a $12 difference. Good. This thing is incredibly hard to steer. I wish you could actually take the wagon out and put pelts in it. That would be great. Pretty sure I just hurt a damn bear. Oh, there's a rider here. Get out of my way, sir. Nope. Alrighty, hopefully this is it. So if you're going fast enough in a wagon... God damn it. If you're going fast enough in a wagon, you can actually drift by holding down R1. Some little crazy feature they had added a while ago when they first put the game in. That guy probably just died by my wheel too. Mm, great. That's all I need. An unarmed assault. That's all I need. How am I gonna deliver this with bounty on me? Let's go faster. Let's go faster. No we don't. No we don't. Just leave me alone. I need to deliver this as fast as I can. You were in my way. Well, oh, this is bull. Please don't shoot me. This would suck. Must go faster. Must go faster. Get out of the wanted level area. Come on. Come on. Don't be going fast. Oh my god. Let's go faster. Oh yeah, then the strange thing about if you've never done a trading thing. There's people to kill when you get there. Which is really confusing. But if you actually drive it right in there, you can kill them later. All you gotta do is deliver it to the station, so... Ah, oh, man, they're still catching up. I'm still catching up! Let's go! Alright, when it's gone, I didn't see the... It's probably like 30 cents or something. For grazing a man. An unarmed assault. He wasn't even dead. Come on. Five thousand two hundred eighty distance traveled by wagon. Nice. I have been grinding the hell out of this game since the new DLC, and I am loving it one hundred percent. I've actually been grinding more on this than GTA lately, so it's a beautiful game. The graphics are amazing. Hopefully, I can just drive this right in without getting shot. And look at that. I thought I was gonna get shot, but maybe not. Goods were delivered. There you go, sir. And we are two hundred fifty sixty-two dollars richer. That's what it is, sixty-two dollars. Two hundred and fifty experience richer trader awards await. What did we get? Okay. Um Do we get a nice I think we got a nice new shiny belt buckle. But anyways, that's going to be it. Just want to do a short, quick video of me trading goods. Pretty much like the bunker in GTA 5. So, I hope you guys liked it. If you did, please leave a thumbs up. Subscribe if you like. If not, no big deal. And I will see you guys in the next one. Have a good one. Peace. Mm -hmm.